What is going on guys? Justin here with Concrete in Disguise and I am here on a job site right now. Um, so today we're going to be installing three bathroom vanities as well as a small little nook piece. Um, so I'm going to take you guys around and kind of show you what everything looks like before we put the countertop. So I'll go ahead and bring you guys into the master bathroom which we'll be doing next. We've got two cabinets right here for two different countertops at two different heights. And then we have matching backsplash that goes all the way around including this little middle section. So we're gonna get started by attaching our sink brackets to the cabinets. Um, so I'm gonna take you guys along with that process. Okay guys, so what we're gonna do right now is set up our sink brackets. Um, the way these work is we've got these little hangers that are actually mount to the front and the back, vice versa, of the cabinet. And then this little rail system actually hooks on to these and then you'll have bolts that come through each one of these holes with little pads, um, almost like feet. That'll help push the sink up to the countertop. So we'll go ahead and get started on that right now. We're gonna go ahead and bring the countertop in and then once it's in place, we'll go up underneath the cabinet and raise the sink up. Alright, so I am currently up underneath the sink because I want to show you guys exactly how these brackets work. So, as you can see, it spans from the front to the back and then these bolts screw up and lift the sink to attach it up. Attaching the backsplash to the wall is just some heavy duty power grab. That's more than plenty to get it held and secured. And then we're gonna actually go back over. And all the joints, we're gonna use our color match silicone and we'll probably do some latex up on the top. That way the painter can come back and paint it the same color as the wall. But here's how we're looking. have been glued down it is now time to use our silicone to fill both the joints in between the backsplash and the countertop as well as we're going to go around the entire inside of the sink so what we're using is a product called polysil it comes from uh, color right it's a company that makes uh, color match silicone so this is the bb13 color version which matches very nice with this color countertop so I'm gonna go ahead and run a bead through there and then the trick is you need to spray it with a little bit of cleaner. We use 409, so what that's gonna do is allow you to run your bead 
and remove the excess from any spots that you don't want it, such as the countertop. So I'll run that through and show you guys how it works. Countertops are now in place, sinks have been secured, and uh, been silicone down. Um, we ran into one slight issue in the master bath, um, where one of our backsplashes did not fit correctly. Not sure exactly what happened yet, um, but we will be remaking it. So that means backsplash is not finished in the master bath, um, but including this video will be us coming back and finishing it out. So next time you see us, it will be a different day, and the backsplash will be in. it for the install I hope you guys all enjoyed uh, following us along on the process uh, if you haven't yet go ahead and like this video and subscribe um, and if you want go ahead and leave something in the comment section showing us um, what kind of content you want to see if you want to see more in-shop stuff if you want to see um, other installs or anything in between so let us know and once again thanks